crime and punishment to those who help catch the criminals. Today, U.S. audio. Er, now, today, U.S. Attorney, excuse me there, Will Thompson was in Bluefield to tour the Wade Center. Thompson's tour today helped him to learn firsthand how a new grant is making it possible for the Wade Center and the Bluefield Police Department to work hand-in-hand -hand to help keep kids on a positive path. The $450,000 from the Department of Justice's Juvenile Justice Delinquency Prevention Program will increase efforts to establish effective education, training, research, prevention, and rehabil rehabilitation programs in juvenile delinquency. That's a along with juvenile justice system improvements. We do the same thing. If we can get one of these kids to change their outlook yes. on, on life as opposed to not wanting to be in the you know, judicial system right. forever, then, then we've won some. The fact that they are giving the kids a safe place, mm -hmm. a place to eat, mm -hmm. a place to study, and a place to play uh, really speaks volumes about the community of Bluefield. Now the Wade Center goes through the fifth grade, but Dillo says this gives the police department a head start on following them through middle school, which can be the most challenging age group. Not only